scientist Puppet Steve here again to cut open some more ooh, of those Series 3 Gujitsu. No, 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 oh, stop, oh, I wanna play with these. No, don't cut them open. Ah, <laughs> uh, yep, I know that'd be Steve, but kids wanna see what's inside these things, and I'm the only one doing it, so let's get to cutting open. Oh, man, oh, I don't like this. All right, kids, we're back to open up some more Gujitsu, and to get started, well, we're gonna have to prep this table. So let's see, let's get out this uh, bag here so we don't get the table all crazy because when we open these things up, oh, they get all goopy. And next thing to do is put on my cutting open Gujitsu gloves here. So let's put these on. And this will protect my hands from getting all goopy. Ugh, gross. Okay, let's see here. Looks like we've got seven of these Gujitsu left. So this time, eh, let's open up a new character. Oh, uh, what about this guy right here, the crazy elephant? Okay, so here we have that crazy elephant guy going under the knife next. And if we pull him uh, like this, we see, oh, man, he's got all kinds of like interesting gujitsu parts. He's got like marbles inside him or something. Oh, uh, weird. I'm kind of curious what those will look like once we get this guy open. So let's see. I put him down here and get all my surgical scissors. <laughs> uh, then we'll cut this guy open to see what flies out of this guy. Okay, boy, this is gonna be cool. So let's see. Get a nice little cut right here so we can open this guy up. And then three, two, one, commence with the cutting. And. Uh, oh, we're, look, there's nothing coming out of him. Except. <laughs> oh, a bunch of marbles. Oh, man. Oh, crazy. But uh, oh, that's it? Yeah, just marbles? They didn't put any liquid in this guy? I mean, I guess there is kind of some liquid, but it's very, very small amount. I mean, my gloves are a little bit damp, but, yeah, but they didn't really put any liquid in this guy. Yeah, that's kind of weird. Huh, neat. So, yep, there's all the, uh, let's see, let's get all of them out on the table here so we can see just how many there are inside of this elephant. All right, cool. So there's the entire contents of this elephant on the table now. Wow, it's so weird. It's not what I thought would be inside them. I thought there'd be a lot more liquid, but nope. It's just these little ball things here. And ugh, these are like hard plastic. So I don't think we can cut these things open if we wanted to. <laughs> nope, that's very, very hard. But yeah, they're like little marbles inside this elephant guy. Oh, weird. So yep, there's our first Gujitsu on the table there. Like I said, there's just a little bit of water on them because my, my gloves are a little bit damp there. Boy, talk about anticlimactic. <laughs> oh, I thought there'd be some more interesting things inside this guy, but nope, that's what's inside that elephant dude right there. And since that was so, uh, well, underwhelming, let's go with this guy right here. Oh, Blazagon, the new Blazagon series two, because I know he's gonna give us all kinds of goopiness. Oh, look at that. <laughs> If we stretch this guy open, oh man. Oh, we got all kinds of little sparkle goops in this dude. Oh, I know good old boys of God won't let me down. So let's see, let's cut him open next because I know things are about to get super goopy now. All right, you ready for this kids? <laughs> this is gonna be great. Okay, so let's see. Get a good uh, cut on him. And in three, two, one, commence with a cut in and... Oh, gross. Oh, man. Oh, so cool. Kind of pours out like jelly. Oh, I love it. <laughs> Just look at this cooping all over that table. Oh, that's so gross. But, yep, this is a jelly like substance that's getting all over my fingers here. And it looks like there's little pieces of confetti here. Kind of like what you see on uh, Valentine's Day, I guess. <laughs> Uh, they're not in the shape of hearts. No, they're perfect. Uh, no, they're not. They, I was gonna say they're circles, but no, they're not circles. They're little hexagons. So yep, if you really zoom in there, maybe you'll see the hexagon shapes. But yep, that is the ugh, the entire goopiness. Yeah, so that's what's in the new Blazagon. That's pretty cool. There are all kinds of different uh, shapes and sizes. That's kind of neat. And yep, like I said, it's kind of like jelly. You don't want to put this on any bread, though. <laughs> Ugh, that'd be gross. But you have to get some peanut butter, though, and put it in there. <laughs> to make it the ultimate goopiness. Oh, that's crazy. So, yep, there is the new Blazagon. 
Ugh, goop and all. Okay, looks like we've got two down already for this episode. And next up, let's see, let's do a third one here. And I think we'll go with, oh, the lizard guy next. Uh, because he looks so cool. I mean, we've got blue, red, and now we'll go with green to complete our primary colors. And if we pull this guy apart, oh, we see that he's kind of like a taffy, taffy guy with, with some more sparkles in him. So, yep, I can't wait to see what this guy looks like when we cut him open. So let's do that right now. So, all right, let's get this show on the road because I want to see what this goo looks outside of the body here. So let's see, let's get a nice cut on this guy. And in three, two, one, time to cut you open. And, oh boy, this is tough. Uh, a lot tougher than the other one. Oh man, nothing's pouring out because <laughs> it's like that taffy substance. Uh, it's kind of hanging in there. Oh man, this is this is not really goopy at all. It's more like a like I said, a taffy. Uh, uh, yeah, we've had this kind of substance before with some other characters like Thrash. So yep, if we zoom in on this guy here. Uh, get all the goopiness out of this guy. And uh, this stuff is thick as molasses. Oh, crazy. So, yep, there's the goo inside this guy. Very tough like taffy that's uh, super sticky, too. Look at that, it's starting to stick to my gloves. Ugh, gross. But if we check out this goop, let's see, a little bit. Yeah, it's starting to harden as it sits. So, yep, just like taffy. But, ugh, so gross. The texture is pretty crazy. And inside we can see all those little pieces of uh, sparkles inside, which are just like the uh, red ones that we just opened. So, yep, they are also hexagon in shape. And, oh man, oh, gross. That's starting to stick to my gloves. Ugh, crazy taffy. But unfortunately, I can't get too much out of this guy because, well, I guess it's kind of sticking to the innards <laughs> of inside the Gujitsu there. So I'm not sure how they even put that gel inside of them because, man, it just sticks to everything. Ugh, gross. Yeah, it'll take me all day to pull that stuff out. So, yeah, we'll just leave them intact like that. But, yep, there's our three Gujitsu now open from dissection. So, all right, looks like we have room for one more Gujitsu to open up here. So we'll do one more for this episode. And since this guy was kind of underwhelming, let's do one I know will get all goopy. And it's ah, this guy right here, good old Pantaro. Oh, look at that. Pull this guy apart. He's got all these little uh, weapons inside of him. Oh, yeah. Look at that. We got liquid in there and everything else. So oh, this is going to get super goopy. So, all right, kids. I can't wait to cut this guy open because this is going to get all over the place. <laughs> okay, Pantaro. So let's see. The Series 2 one. Let's open this guy up in a three. Two, one, and cut this guy open! And... <laughs> oh man, look at that! Oh, he's starting to drip! And whoa, crazy! He's not. Oh man! <laughs> oh, there he goes! I was gonna say he's not dripping as much as I thought he would there, but. Uh, uh, dripping out of his body! Oh man! And I thought it was gonna be all water, but nope, it's not water, it's like some gelatinous substance. Put him down there and check out these contents. Just look at that. Ooh, gross. <laughs> it's like a baby oil oozy stuff or something. Oh, that's so gross. And then inside, we've got these little uh, Chinese whippets here. What is those? Chinese stars, I think. And boy, there are a lot of them in this guy. Look at that. About like uh, 20 or 30 of them or so. I don't think I even emptied this guy out yet. So, yep. <laughs> yeah. so, yep, more of them coming out. Oh, just oozing on out of there. Oh, gross, look at my gloves from this guy. So, yep, there's a bunch of contents in that. And what's kind of cool is each one of these Gujitsu has something different, entirely different in their body. So, that's kind of cool for this episode. Some of them are goopy, some of them aren't. But, yep, that's what's inside Pantaro. And, uh, just look at this clear body. Oh, he's empty now. <laughs> oh, there he is, just an empty shell. Yeah. 
And of course, at the end of the day, oh, mama, just look at all the destruction we caused. Ugh, gross, cutting them all open. We've got jam gooey stuff over here. We've got this taffy stuff over here. We've got these little marbles. And over here, we've got this baby gel-like substance. All right, kids, like I've said before, don't do this stuff at home because leave it to me, Puppet Steve, to do this for you and show you what's inside these things. And make sure you subscribe to this channel because we've got more of these to open, like good old Hydra here. Oh, man, I know you don't want me to open this guy up because it's so hard to find, but we're going to do it in our final episode of Opening Up the Gujitsu Part 7.